The Research Institute for Fragrance Materials, or RIFM, was founded in 1966 to help ensure that fragranced consumer products can safely be enjoyed. The key to RIFM's mission is its safety assessment program. Safety assessments are toxicological evaluations of individual ingredients used for their fragrance producing properties. RIFM's current series of safety assessments follows a set of criteria developed in 2013 to take advantage of the latest internationally accepted methodologies and avoid animal testing. Since the publication of its criteria document, RIFM has saved more than half a million animals. RIFM's research program has been committed to developing and confirming new non-animal methodologies for more than a decade. RIFM's safety assessment process begins with the prioritization of fragrance ingredients. First, we group materials with similar structures and toxicological profiles and review all available current and historical data. RIFM evaluates hazards and risks for six areas of human health and potential impact on the environment. Scientists refer to these areas as endpoints. The endpoints include genotoxicity, repeated dose toxicity, reproductive toxicity, skin sensitization, photoirritation and photoallergenicity, local respiratory toxicity, and environmental toxicity. Sometimes there isn't enough data on an ingredient to ensure that an endpoint is safe. In those cases, we may use data for a chemically similar stand-in ingredient. This internationally accepted methodology is called read across because scientists read data across from one ingredient to another. If we cannot identify an appropriate read across stand in, our next step is to determine whether the exposure to the ingredient falls beneath the threshold of toxicological concern, or TTC. The TTC was first conceived in 1990 in a review of the US FDA regulatory policy on food additives. Because fragrance ingredients are used at such low levels, most of them fall comfortably below the TTC. Read Across and TTC are just two of the cutting-edge methodologies and tools RIFM uses to avoid testing on animals. The expert panel for fragrance safety, an independent body of academic experts with no ties to industry, reviews and must approve all RIFM safety assessments. Panel members are experts in different fields of toxicology, dermatology, and chemistry. Founded in 1967, the self-governing expert panel provides additional scientific authority and objectivity to RIFM's work. Once the expert panel has approved a safety assessment, it is posted to RIFM's database for the use of members and other database subscribers, and it is then submitted to Elsevier's Food and Chemical Toxicology Journal for peer review, adding another layer of objectivity to RIFM's work. RIFM is committed to the complete transparency of its work. That is why all of its peer-reviewed safety assessments are available through a partnership with Elsevier via the Open Access Fragrance Material Safety Assessment Center. To date, RIFM has published safety assessments covering more than 1,500 fragrance raw ingredients and dozens of supportive research and criteria papers, all of which you can download for free via the Resource Center. RIFM expects to have published safety assessments for all known fragrance raw ingredients currently in use by the end of 2022. Got a question for the Research Institute for Fragrance Materials? Visit our website at rifm.org or send us an email to rifm at rifm.org.